Hey guys, Dubious Dick, and welcome to one of my favorite games of all time, Crash Bandicoot Wrath of Cortex. I mean, I have a lot of favorite games of all time, so I shouldn't be <laughs> too complimentary, but it's a Crash Bandicoot game, which means it's pretty damn fine. Alright, start a new game to get straight into this, and hopefully I still know most of it like the back of my hand, because if I do, then that's a good thing. When it decides to load. Now this is for the original Xbox, but I'm playing it through 360 on capture. And well, let's watch the intro cutscene. Imbeciles, fools, nincompoops. Can't you idiots do anything right? You're not very nice, are you? This. Your track record for spreading evil is pathetic. Uga uga, it's not our fault that Richard Bandicoot is to blame. Sure he is. Okay, I, I can't be asked watching it, I want to play the game. What happens is, they decide to harness the power of the elements to try and stop Crash. Because reasons... Crash Bandicoot, my old nemesis. You fuck! How the heck are you? Still How the crystals. heck are you? Old habits die hard, don't they? My days are being spent on something much more intriguing. Meet Crunch. My newest oh, yeah. creation. <laughs> the Mr. T clone of Crash. This is the creature who keeps sabotaging your master plan? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. I'll exterminate this field right in no time. I remember him being more Mr. Oh wait, no, that was in like, Crash now, crunch, the Crash the Titans. They made him more like enough. Mr. T, I think. Isn't he brilliant? A testament to my true scientific genius. A real bandicoot warrior. Unlike you, Crash. Stop stroking oh, well, your cortex, cortex. Ta -ta for now. No? Okay. Yes, ta-ta. Oh boy. Fuck, I love this game. Alright. Where should we go first? Oh wait, we've only got like one level. Actually no, yeah, we've got access to five, that's right, that's how warp rooms work. Let's go straight to level one. Ah yes, and I still remember how to get the blue chim. Whew, this is gonna be fun. What are you looking at, fuzzhead? I'm Rocco, the Earth Elemental. Uka Uka and Dr. Cortex woke me from my captive slumber, and now I'm free to pulverize whatever gets in my way. Oh, don't even think about collecting those crystals, Run. Because if you do, I'm going to bury you alive. Earth Elemental, you piece of shit. Alright. Which is funny, because we go into like the land of ice, and I'm pretty sure ice is a different element. Or is that in Rayman 2? Boxes! Is there anything behind us? I don't think there is. No. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, Crash does a little guitar slide. A guitar riff. Can you slide jump in this? Do do. Do do. Ugh. Gotta spin just a second before you hit the box. Damn it, just a little bit too early there. Cause I could have gotten in. Aku Aku. Protector mask. I mean, I'm sure you guys know some stuff that you picked up on when I was doing Love Dead Crash Bandicoot, but, you know, some of you might not know. Some of you might not have had this privilege growing up, to which I feel very sorry for you. Jump on it. Jump on it. There we go. Bouncy. 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 Used to be 10 bounces, but I think I realized people kind of get sick of that. I mean, I have Crash 2, which I'll probably play at some point. This was just a bit easier for me to set up. And I've also 100%ed Crash 2 already. So it'll be a bit boring if I go back into it again. Well, not boring, but... Uh, actually, no, Crash is never boring. I even have Crash to Insanity on disc as well, still. I used to have them all, but... Well, we got sold in the move to Australia. Because we couldn't take it with us because of NTSC, how, all of that. Oh, fuck, I didn't mean to spin. Lost my wampers, man. Get him. There we go. That's weird, not having double jump yet. Cross it. Oh, we've got skid jump, and that's, that's all we really need for now. Body slam. Get ourselves an extra life. Nice catch. 
That's right, you better get all three. Don't you guys spin me, that's my thing. That's the bandicizzle thing. Ah, oh, almost got the Aku Aku. Didn't really time that well. Get this guy over here. Bouncy, bounce, 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 break. There we go. Four breaks in Wrath of Cortex. Ten breaks in the old games. Alright, now for something that was always a little bit complicated, but you get an extra life for doing it, so it's totally worth it. Fuck. Well, I got a life and then I lost a life. But now I reset the dare, so I can't do the dare. Which is a bonus level for not dying. To get the blue gem, but then again, I want to get the silver gem in this run, which is for getting all of the boxes. And you can't get all the boxes if you do the dare. This win-lose sort of thing going on. Go. Break. Thank you. Actually, if I bounce off him and onto the boat. I want most of this video to just be me trying to get that extra life. Okay. It's a good way to grind for lives, actually, because it's one preferred, but I don't need to grind for lives. Two pro skills for that, bro. Oh, wait, no. It's become five bounces now. There we go. Nailed it. First try. You guys have seen the Lego movie. One of my favorite lines. Check pop on here. Oh wait, no. Get up there. Oh, there's a box. I didn't realize I hadn't broken one. Come on, bounce, 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 break. Alright. Alright, Bobby. Wait, did I get all of them? Was there not sure? I'm not entirely sure if I got all of them. Okay. Well, if not, then that will be embarrassing. Get back across here. We're all good, baby. Yeah. Power crystals here, yes! Sure. Please. Yeah, it's turned from 4 Wampers to 5 Wampers. Because, of course, it has. No, neither. Right. See, there's another guy. There's another guy there, and I think you can get to him. Hey look, I got the silver gem. That's all good. Can you get up to him? Yes, you can. You can jump on top of him though. That's a different issue. Maybe he's an easter egg. We would have gotten an achievement if this was a 360 port. Fuck it. Wrath of Cortex HD. Only in cinemas now. Oh, I used to love this loading screen because it comes down and then his little nose is bobbling. Ah, look at it! Oh, okay. Just fanboying out a little bit, don't mind me. Spur, spur. Yeah, you do that. Right, uh. Before we cap off this video by doing the gem run. The blue gem. I have a habit of putting the blue gem on the first level. In Crash 2, you can get it by doing the first level without breaking any boxes. When I say you can get it, I mean that's the only way to get it. I know my Crash shit, man. I, mean, I could do the time trial, but I can't really be fun. Maybe if this video doesn't go up to 15 minutes, I can do it. Probably not. Just get easy. Ah, uh, there's a TNT that I just spun. But I got another Aku Aku regardless. It sucked that I lost a life already because I was at the end exit and then enter the level again. Just to get the dare. At least it's not like the original crash where you had to do the thing. Uh, have to beat every level without dying just to get the gem. Which, getting all the gems gave you a really shit alternate ending. <laughs> but hey, it was more for the bragging rights, I guess, because that game was balls hard. Like, it was ridiculously hard. And yes, I 100%ed it on beta. Because I have no life. 
And I just really fucking like Crush Bandicoot, okay? Leave me alone. A little bit of depth perception issue going on, I feel. Pick a little bit further than I actually am. Further? Further. One new doisy. Right, get over there. Over this. Over here and there. Oh, almost got hit by him as I was doing this thing. It's annoying how you can't body slam off and bounce off something then. Oh, don't you touch me, you bastard. Yeah, invincible. Actually, that's not going to do me much good, is it? There's the bears right there. Okay. And it's all just nitros, so there's no boxes up here. And you hit the nitro switch like I did at the end of the level and you get all the nitros, so that's how they made it so that they can have a separate area but not have the boxes affect your normal run. Which is a good piece of design. Something I like. Which I like a lot of design choices about the original, like these Star Crash games. Apparently not many people like this one that much, like critically, but I fucking love it. I thought it was did me solid when I was a kid doing. See here, there's boxes, but they're right next to Nitro, so if you hit the end of level Nitro box, you don't fuck up like I just did. Then you get all the boxes. Come on! <laughs> Maybe a little bit of a delayed reaction time because it's like I'm getting old, man. I don't know what that was once. Can I not finish this now because of this? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe if I die. Maybe if I bounce off it with an Akiraki. Nope. Well, shit, I can't finish the level from here now. Unless I kill myself. I mean, I've already got the blue jam, so. Is it easier to just run ahead and finish the level normally? Yeah, probably. I can't believe I forgot to get that life last time. Oof, I'm an idiot. Yep, here's where you get the crystal. And there's the end of the level. See, this is the nitro box I was talking about. And you know what? Probably have a little bit of extra time to go and get that relic. Hmm. What do you guys reckon? You can't tell me because it's not live. I don't know why I said that. Um, boing, 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 loading, loading, boing, 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 boing. You guys have a silly Ed's World cartoon, which should be like, doing, 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 doing. Yeah, fuck it. 115, element 115, Nazi zombies confirmed. Treyarch, why? Actually, I realise you guys might be getting sick of seeing this level, but too late. I've committed. Gonna try and get that sapphire. All right. Yep. Cool. You notice in time trial mode, these yellow boxes come up, which freeze the clock for. Ah, oh, I need echo echo. There we go. Can't believe I missed that. Gonna hamper. My score from reaching a gold. I think you can even reach platinum in the first level without having the sprint function which you get at the end of the game. Worth it. Yep, skip jump, skip jump. Skip jumps. I think they speed me up. I do believe they do anyway. I didn't want to bounce off it. We shouldn't be skip jumping as much in here because of the smaller jumps, but yeah. There we go, a little box bounces help as well. Alright. Is it worth it? Yeah, that saves me a whole two seconds. That saves me three, and that saves me another two. I'm getting over here. No, they didn't give me anything. I was kind of hoping that, that three quest from exclamation point thing would give me some more. Come on, come on, we can do this. Please give me gold. I'm not sure if that's sapphire or 
platinum. I think it would probably be so far. we go. Cobbin first. Ah. <sighs> but, uh, yeah. That was first episode of Wrath of Cortex. Hope you liked it. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Yeah, you look real fucking happy about getting that donut crush.